how I do a mohawk for a pet dog. I need to have this brushed out first. Let me just uh, get my long pinned tooth brush, slicker brush. So this is Ted, he is my friend's uh, cockapoo and I like him on a shortcut. So how I start off is I sweep the hair from side to side to see where I've already done it. Now if you're starting with a dog that is fully coated on the head, then always find where your ear is and make a direct line from there to there. I always use the 10 blade. Good lad, Ted. Good lad. Sweep that aside. None of my tippy toes right now, so I can see everything above me. Okay. And then I will just twizzle him around with his head. Good boy, it's a good lad. And do the same. So find where the top of my ear is there. Just lower this a little bit for your head. There we go. with pet dogs. If you were to go with a 30, you might fold it too much. So a 10 just gives it that, that bit more of hair. Okay, so you can see I'm getting the pattern of the mohawk. And what I then do is I'll brush this forward, use my straight scissors and scissor. Brush forward again. See this a little bit there. And there. Right, so some of the hair isn't exactly laying the same way. Leave my straights to make sure that it's all level. This is the part where I'll get my chunkers because you can see that flopping. And there are my tippy toes. And everything overhanging, I am just using with my chunkers. And then I'll do the same on this side. and my straights and I will uh, video and show you the finished look.